All right, my good people, welcome back to Greta Father. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Please remember to like and subscribe. Start this little video off. You're going to take, you know, take a little shot. That was some Jose. Jose Cuevo, cheap ass tequila. You can see Trevor up there. Let me see if I. I, I, oh, I can't switch to him. Like, right, look at him. Why am I bloody? I didn't even do anything. Let's get it, guys. Howdy. Howdy. But yeah, man, I hope, I hope y'all doing well. Hope y'all feeling good today. It's Sunday at the time you're recording this video. That's disgusting. Oh, nice place you got here. Oh, yeah. It's easy to mock, isn't it, huh? Cheap and fucking easy. <laughs> but uh, this, this here is my place. And my work paid for my place. All right, relax. I was just being sarcastic. Yeah, well, don't be, all right? Because the world doesn't need any more sarcasm. It's the blight of the age. Yeah, I get the point. You, you don't get the point. You're like every other asshole. You made a bit of money, and you became a turd. Mm -hmm. Yeah, news for you. I was always a turd. No! You weren't, man. You were something. But now, man, you know, you're like this place. You're a shell. Go fuck yourself. Are you some kind of pure, morally justifiable asshole? What, because you're, you're, you're totally psychotic, somehow it's okay? I'm honest, all right? You're the hypocrite. Oh, yeah, you're a fucking hero. So far above it all. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm not above ripping open your fucking chest to see what's replaced your heart. Rip it open. See what's there, baby, because I'm ready. <laughs> Hello? Oh, ladies, ladies, what's up? Fuck off! Listen, I'm sorry, but we've got a problem. Government funding thing. We need you to uh, investigate a research lab upstate. It's about terrorism, the big one, nerve gas, biological terror. Thank God I don't pay tax. Uh, listen, you'll need some fairly standard gear. A boat? Tandem rotor heavy lift helicopter, truck, weapons. You'll have to source all of that. <laughs> Chopper alone will set you back a couple of mil. Oh, no worries there. Trevor here, he just came into a lot of money. Is that sarcasm? Oh, you're fucking A right at sarcasm. You fuck. A few weeks ago, I was happily retired, blood is on sulking by my swimming pool. And my psychotic best friend shows up out of nowhere to torture me over mistakes I made. Honest mistakes I made over a decade ago. We? Our little posse are flat fucking broke. But hey, let's go out and spend two million dollars on a tandem rotor fucking chopper so I can go steal nerve gas from fucking terrorists. Forgive me, you ignorant fuck. But sarcasm is all I fucking got. <laughs> sarcasm and a room full of you cunts. Yes. Woo. Welcome back, man. It is the old you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we gotta go. It's been great, but Dave here's got a Pilates class. Now, remember, ladies, you keep us way out of this thing. Bye-bye. Ah, oh, Jesus fucking Christ. All right, I'll give Lester a fucking call. He said he knew about something. Now, you tell him that we're driving towards Polito Bay. And around, around this time of the story, like... A little bit before Michael and them steal, well, before Trevor stole Martin's wife. I think this is the peak of the story around this part, in my personal opinion. Let's drive this trash ass car. Still got blood on you, man. Let me call Lester. What now? We got Man. a funding Man. problem. Man. So we need a job. Before the jewel store, you talked about a score, a, a bank in the sticks. I need you to meet us there. Polito Bay, right? That's the one. I'll get on a bus. All right, Lester's meeting us there. Don't start. I won't. No way. Good call. If you're taking down a bank for a few million, first thing you do is call the hospital, tell them to get you a guy in a wheelchair. <laughs> oh, 
This Hayseed Bank, you gonna be carrying that kind of change? Local law enforcement extort money from all the weed farms, whorehouses, meth kitchens in the area. They keep their cash in safe deposit boxes. Then there's all the normal small town payroll stuff. We should do well. You know, I've been thinking about you, Trevor. Your lifestyle. Oh, have you? Really? Yes, I have. People always try to label you. You know? Maniac, psycho, friend, industry leader. Uh, some ways you defy categorizations. But then... What? Think about it. It's where you live. Sandy Shores, you precious ass. I'm sorry there ain't a place nearby for you to get your colonics. Right. But why are you out here? It's off the grid. We're away from it all. It's somewhere real and authentic. This is America! And real people ain't been priced out yet. Yeah, well, what if it gets gentrified? Then I'll fucking move. Okay. What about the way you dress? What about it? I don't give a shit what I wear. No, no, no. If you don't give a shit, you wear clean clothes that fit. So yours are all a little out there, you know, a little wacky. Whatever's in the shop is what I get. Jesus, what is this? It's not an absence of taste, T. It's the opposite of taste. You should be a stylist. And then there's the tattoos, the hair, the weird music, the funny toys, the niche drugs, the everything. What the fuck are we talking about? You are a hipster. What? You're a hipster. I hate hipsters. Classic hipster denial. I abhor hipsters. I eat them for fun. <laughs> hipsters love saying they hate hipsters. What I really fucking do? Self-hatred. Common hipster affliction. Why won't be because I'm living out here away from the bean machines and the bankers? You're gentrifying. Soon, the skinny jeans will show up. The bus stops up here. How funny is it? All right. That was a funny How long did it take us to get out here from LS? A couple hours, man. It's gonna take some time. Come on, man. Knock it off. What? I'm gonna break your fucking fingers, you don't knock that shit off. Well, please, all right? You'd alleviate the boredom. Ah, finally. Why they all sit in the back of the bus together like that? Hey, hey. Hey. Welcome to paradise. Come on, car's this way. Dry out here. Don't worry, brother. Mark will take care of all your moisturizing needs. Mm. Oh. Shall we? Might as well get started. Drive us to the bank. I will go to the front of the bank, clock the entrance. If the paperwork's correct, the alarm will be a relic. We should be in and out before the local PD knows what's happening. <laughs> now that's the entrance to the bank. Nothing special. It'll take us around back. Okay. I ain't counting bank. I like it. Man, the place is remote. It's got the right amount of foot traffic. This'll do. Mm hmm. It's not ideal. It's gonna cost more to break that system than the score is gonna pay. Well, we're gonna have to find a new score. No, 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 uh-uh, no, no. This is the score. Right? What are our options? It's a dumb idea, but we could trigger the alarm. See what kind of response they throw out. That is a dumb idea. Hey, you heard the man, all right? Shoot the sucker. Shoot the sucker. Okay, I brought my police scanner to drive over to the gas station opposite the bank and we'll monitor chatter. All right. Services frequency. We have a code 30 Adam. Alarm going off at Blaine County Savings Bank. All cars in the area, please respond. Bolito cars three, six, nine, and one will be there in 50 seconds. 50 seconds. Roger that. Four units. 
It's a pretty fast response, huh? Uh, they've dispatched four cars in 60 seconds and more on standby, and it isn't even 30 Victor shots fired. Oh, this is a real headache. What do you got on the clock? 40 seconds. This is Polito Security. Any updates on the Code 30 Adam? Backup ready to mobilize. This is not normal. The response is out of proportion. Cops in this county are dirty. And the alarm just went off on their piggy bank. That response time is insane, though. This is them. What is that, a 67 second response time? Yeah, four cars. More in the wings. Bad cops, garden dirty money. Fuck how many? We can take this. Wait right here. We'll see if anything about their routine suggests a weakness. Polito Radio, this is Polito Car 3. We have a code 12. False alarm. Possibly triggered intentionally. Roger that. We're gonna set up checkpoints on the Great Ocean Highway and the Sonora Freeway. Car to car searches and record checks. Checkpoints? Searches? Fuck this! I ain't getting caught because Lester needs a wheelchair. Up, hey! Wheelchair or not, we're still faster than your ass! I'm not gonna outrun a cop. We've gotta go. We're going. And if we're in front of Trevor, he'll be the one running from the cops. I shouldn't have come. I should have known. We're fine. We're gonna get out of here. Trevor Phillips, of course this would turn into a car chase. We're not being chased. Not yet. What are you blaming Not at me? all. Look, take a deep breath. We're gonna be fine. We just gotta get back to... Trevor's office? When Trevor says office, he really means... A burnout gas station by the Alamo Sea? I've seen the title of ownership. Get off the road up here. This must be Trevor's route through the mountains. Uh, dirt track. Might get bumpy. And judging by the glassware he ordered a year ago, I'm guessing it's a meth lab. A meth lab! Just perfect! Laboratory don't do it justice. It's more of a shithole where meth is made. Great! Nothing like a pharmaceutical bakery to prep the perfect stick-up job. Don't worry. It's gonna be fine. Why you Look, you had any ideas about the bank? Are you sure we can't disable the alarm? The alarm is a UXVF 111 classification. Minute long relay interval, third party verification, multiple monitoring centers. Sure, I can disable it. But? But it'll cost more than the job is worth. Of course it will. So, what do we do? The trouble when I we add. Walk away. It's not like we need the money. Looks like the road takes a dip and a turn after that bridge. Slow down. Uh, about that. You've been day trading? No, God no. I mean, yeah, 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 I've been trading, but no, that's not why we need the money. Then why do you need the money? <laughs> All right, so, there's this research laboratory on the coast. The IAA are using it to manufacture a poison gas that they're going to release on U.S. soil in order to hope that the government increases their funding. That sounds idiotically improbable enough to be possible, but what's it got to do with you and Trevor sticking up the Blaine County Savings and Loan? Agent Steve Haynes needs two million plus to finance a raid on the lab. And guess who's doing the raid? And guess who's paying for it? Ah, I see. Yeah, well, I don't. Oh my god. I don't really there. see. But I'm doing it. And it sounds like Trevor would hit this bank for candy and a pat on the head. Now tell me. Can we do it, or do we move on? Now you can do it, but you can't do it clean. How messy are we talking? Taking the cops head on, messy. Well, they are dirty cops. That's what Trevor says. So do you think we can do it? Guys out here aren't trained like the LSPD. They aren't going to be prepared for a well-armed, well-drilled team coming straight for them. Yeah, well, we need an edge. Something to tip the odds in our favor. Yeah, I got a couple ideas. <laughs> All right. Smoking that motherfucker. So I picked Michael so they can, we can have a conversation. The riding with Trevor is just, you know, just on the bike by himself. He ain't saying shit. Well, we got here before the Lord of the Manor. <laughs> the man slows me down. Always has. What took you so long? <laughs> Damn.
Dang, I forgot to pick up Packy. <coughs> Set up a board over here. I know it's things oh. in that motherfucker. Cause... Michael, man, your blood sugars are low. I'm making you some leftovers. I'm fine, T. Huh? No, I'm the host, man. You know, I don't want you to get hungry and moody, all right? Then you're going to be making the wrong decisions. Man, I've been making wrong decisions my whole life. That's how I ended up here. Here you go. Bon appetito. Jesus Christ, Trevor, what is that? What's wrong with you? That's just a... a what? An eyelid. It's probably not even human. <laughs> Unless that gas station job. Gentlemen, some plans for your attention? Good. I'm gonna stay here a minute longer than I have to. So I think our little uh, experiment showed that the response will be too quick to beat and too strong to walk through. That means you gotta face the cops head on. Dirty cops. Uh, the dirty cops head on. Head on. Man, I don't know. It's gonna be yeah, you'll be either. prepared. Convoys carrying military grade hardware pass near here to get to Fort Zancudo. I propose hijacking one and using the equipment to get an edge on the locals. I can get you the exact details of the shipment as soon as we're done here. Anyway, you won't be outside the bank too long. Polito Bay is, well, it's a bay. So you're a street away from the water where Franklin can be waiting in a boat to get you out of there. I know none of this is ideal, but it's the only way I can see of taking the score and providing for your FIB paymasters. Fine. Okay. We need personnel? Just a gunman. He'll be taking on the cops with you, so my advice? Choose someone good. Eh, think about my buddy's chef, okay? Consummate professional. I'm, I'm you sure chef. this is the guy? Wish we had Packy, man. I hate that. I forgot to pick his ass up. I'll try to pick him up for the next time. That should life. do. I'll get the equipment together. Michael, you reach out to Franklin. Trevor, mm -hmm. you do what you do. Roger that. And I'll call you when we're ready to move on this. Mm, you want to bunk with us? I mean, it's going to be tight, but, you know, me casa su casa. Huh? I, I'll get a motel, thanks. Why don't you show? Fine, I'll give you a ride. Adios, amigos. Hmm? Why oh, he eating that nasty shit? Oh. <laughs> Smoking crazy good. <laughs> oh. Oh. He a nasty oh. motherfucker, man. Weird. A nasty dude. <laughs> we gonna go ahead and get on these heists. I would like to do this whole heist industry. Franklin, buddy, what's up? Hey, look, there's these redneck dudes been looking for you, homie. Some angry motherfuckers. I found where they stay, man, and I've been following them. Okay, well, it's got to be the O'Neill brothers. <laughs> what's left of them? I'll pick up Michael, and we'll come to you. Damn, already? T, hey, man. Why you say T, hey, man, like that? Do I need to switch? Do I need to switch to Trevor? I mean, Franklin? Guys, can I switch to him? It's going to start the mission, right? Yeah, I think it will because it's taking longer. Or did my game just glitch? Did my game glitch? I thought it did. If he's back in Sandy Shores, why didn't I hear about it? God damn it! That nigga mad as hell. Shit! They see us, man. We gotta stay on. We on your ass, boy. That's right, chop. We gonna fuck them up as soon as Trevor get here. Hey, man. Me and Chop on these punks. We coming up to WH. North of two miles. All right, all right. The O'Neill brothers are coming to us. I think they was about to send one of them anti-tank rockets into your Vespucci condo. When one of your roomies told them that you was gone. Okay, so if you're on the WH, that means you'll be coming through Ratton Canyon, right? Shit, I guess. Good. Me and MT are going to take the company chopper and meet you there. Company chopper, yes, Michael. It's a tax write-off. Frank, you still there? Yeah, I'm just about holding on to the road. We're taking a chopper and we'll head you off. Deal with these business stealing pricks on the road. Hey, dog, can you, like, get on it? Because these dudes is rolling hard. We're five minutes out from the chopper. All right. Fucking hell! Hell! <laughs> shit, shit, shit! That probably would have killed him in real life, though. I'm not going to lie. 
That probably would have killed him. Shit on me! <laughs> the shit on me! I got your back, homie. Find him. Oh shit! <laughs> Trevor, man, shit, you there? There was a deer in the road, man. These motherfuckers crashed out. They crashed? They dead? No, nah, they gone. They ran into the fucking woods, man. I need air support like right fucking now. Let's get it. Don't worry. Incoming! Why did it stop you? Incoming? Man, you're all business. Yeah, well, this is kind of important. These men don't like me, and they know we're back in the sandy shore, so... Here she is, the Biz Heli. Remember, she ain't mine, the she's Heli. the company's. He spray paints the side of it. <laughs> this motherfucker's funny to me, bro. Trevor's a funny-ass nigga, man. Bigfoot right there. I can't zoom in. That's a little, you know, Check a little the they might be Easter egg. Out of here. <laughs> uh, yeah, he looks like a human being. I got him. Smoke. Moving target brought down. We gotta keep looking. Is that one? No way, I missed that. That was right on the fucking back, man. I'm gonna sit tree or something. Higher ground, Mikey. You find them on the head. Shit! Shit! What is that? He's behind the get rock. That I can't get a shot. It's on you, homie. You know what Hicks smell like. Come on. I'll go find his ass. Take him down, Frank. We're about to get shot out of the sky here. Don't worry, man. We got this. Hey. If you swimming, I am too. Fuck. This water is cold as a motherfucker. Come on, chop. You gotta go faster than that, my homie. What are you? Running beside it. That boy? We closing in. Hey, you can't run their heels in this game. Burn you, dick. Get him, chop fuck his ass up. You ain't getting this, O'Neal, brother. Sorry, I got you. Come on, chop bite his ass. Last guy's done, homie. All right, stay there. We'll come down and pick you up. We easy done. Easy killing. All right, now that the angry hillbillies with rockets are dead, is there anyone else we should worry about trying to kill you? Oh, sure. Yeah, there's some bikers, the Chinese, Madrezo's people, but whatever. Don't act like you're so popular. <laughs> Get it! Get it! Next stop! 
I know that dog is scary in the way he ain't scared of being in a helicopter like that. The lighting glitch over there. You know the airfield's mine, don't you? Oh yeah, you can afford a runway, but you can't afford to move out of that corrugated metal death shack. So how you guys doing? Well, we're alive. Hey, good work down there. I'm the one who says thank you. He was helping me. Thank you, Franklin. Yeah, it's cool, homie. And thank you, Chop. Hey, are you gonna tell us exactly what we were helping with? I know you said these guys stole some business, but that doesn't really explain why they wanted you dead. Oh, uh, didn't I say what happened after they stole the contract? Nope, you didn't. Uh, I went to their farm and I killed a lot of them and then I blew it up. Killed a lot of them? Yes! I think that was Elwood, Walton, and Wynn who we killed just then. I killed Ernie, Earl, Dale, Doyle, Daryl, Dalton, and Don, and a few <laughs> other guys when I blew up the farm. So, maybe this is kind of a revenge thing. I don't know. Let's not forget that I'm the wrong party here. Coming into land. Don't it feel good, huh? Helping a friend in need? Come on, Chop. Come on. Oh, yeah. Taking out some hillbilly crank dealers on a blood feud. That's what I live for. Hey, Trev, man, we're going to borrow... Hey, that was some good-ass country acting just did sure. this, Come on, Michael, man. I'll drop your ass off on the way back. Chop, get in. See you back at Castle Phillips, Mike. Yeah, thanks for the warning. <laughs> Easy. Wow. Headshots? Fuck out of here. Of course my shit's been fucking impounded. Is they gonna let me start working on this heist? I would like to do the heist in this video. Might make the video a little longer so I can put it in here. Okay. Where is it at over here? We'll go ahead and get that while we got Trevor. Trevor! Martin! You know, I've been thinking about it, and I'm not quite sure if I'm ready to accept an apology. Where is my wife? Patricia doesn't want to speak to you. Frankly, neither do I. I will find you! Okay. Well, I'll put some coffee on then. I'll see you soon. <laughs> We're heading towards that way. So I can probably really keep straight, actually. Yeah, I can keep straight down that road and I should just catch him. Now that he's gonna turn. Hopefully he doesn't turn right there. If he doesn't turn right there, I should go straight on his road. Oh yeah, I remember that's a Duco Death Car. I was all about that. They is coming this way, right? Yeah, they are. I ain't got any mines. I ain't got sticky bombs. Coming this way, right? Coming kind of fast. My car about to blow up. Don't get why my shit about to blow up like that. Keep me covered. Easy work. That was kind of beautiful. I ain't gonna lie. Saw my car getting fucking blown up. That was a beautiful setup, though. Easy. 
Boy, watch out for them goddamn IEDs. That's probably a bad joke. Harsh and said that. Now you can't even see. Yeah, I love Sprunk. That was real easy right there, though. The only thing I got shot. I don't go when my car blew up, though. Like, I wasn't even, it wasn't even close to the explosion. And I know they didn't hit my fuel tank. I don't think the AI can hit fuel tanks. I know in this game you can kind of hit the fuel tank a little bit and it'll make it leak. Easy. Oh, we we did it. That was real easy just then. Headhunter. Man, fuck these headshots. I think that's all I needed for this heist, right? You should have called Lester. Lester the molester, bro. We got ourselves some military hardware. It's parked out back in my office. All right. We might be ready to move on this thing. Meet me up in the lab. Let's get it. It's actually, it's, this is another real fun heist because it's so fucking chaotic. There's really a lot of heist in this game, man, when you really think about it's, it. It's, it's not inappropriate. It's, it's another one of your fucking disasters. That's what it is. First you take a hostage against my advice and then you start some kind of crazy high school romance with her. Are you nuts? She's, she's a 60 year old housewife. Wow, she's 57. And she thinks that I'm mature. Yeah, well, let me tell you something. 30 years of marriage to the world's angriest mob boss oh. would make anyone insane. You're not making my situation any easier. Oh, there's a surprise. I knew it would become about you. I miss my family. Oh, you're full of shit. All you ever did was ignore them, and now that they're gone, you miss them. Fucking incredible. I'll tell you what's incredible. Fucking incredible. Hey. You mother... Hey! Why? No! You got me out here. You wrote me into your crazy world of bullshit. If it was lies, new age shit, and arguments about how good life used to be, I could have stayed my ass in Los Santos. <laughs> Hello, Franklin. What's up? All right. Hello to arguments, because our arguments are hilarious. We're going to Palato Bay. And we're going to do this thing. Any questions? Comments? Yeah. I miss Brad. That crazy motherfucker was with us now. He would have loved this. Instead, he's got to enjoy himself molesting white-collar criminals in a federal penitentiary. Thanks for sharing. Anybody else? What about me? You'll be waiting for them by the river, handling the getaway. All right. Now, these three go in. They grab the tape. They rendezvous with you, and you get out of there. Is that a uh, work for everyone? Great. Let's go. Let's get it. That suit Joe got on kind of icy, though. Come on. We got a score to take. Yes, sir. Drive up to the pier. You ever hit a bank before, Franklin? Yeah, I was the driver on the job my boy Lamar pulled. Guess it's the same kind of shit we doing now, right? Nice, bro. What was the take? Shit, I don't know, man. I can't remember. Come on. Everyone remembers their first score. Shit, not me. Huh? Mikey, bro, what was your first bank score? 88, outskirts of Carcer City. Took a small franchise for 10G. Yeah, things were easier back then. Yeah, 25 years ago. Jesus! Chef, will you tell these gentlemen about your first job? Gee, man. You could just as easily. You tell him. I'll do a sanity check. Trevor, the ultimate judge of sanity. 
Well, it was uh, part of the interview process, I guess is how you'd call it. Trevor knew I could cook, wanted to see if I could handle myself. This cash for gold guy comes through town. It's the reason he had funds. Next thing, we're burying him and his bodyguard in the junkyard. Well, <laughs> most of them, anyhow. 50K. He did fine. Oh, He's 50. better at all aspects of the job now, from killing to dismemberment. Hey, your turn to share, kid. I told you I don't remember the details, man. Leave him alone, Trevor. This is an important moment, Michael. Here we are, on our way to almost certain death, bonding, pouring our hearts out, and this guy is sitting here, soaking it up and giving nothing in return. Hey, if he don't remember... If he don't remember? I'm supposed to trust this man with my life, and he don't trust me with the details of his first bank job? Well, how about you? Why don't you share with the group? I'm here. I'll back the facts. A check's cash place? I went in, took him for eight grand, walked out. Yeah. It was a bit more complicated than that, though, wasn't it, T? Maybe I knew the guy. Maybe he ID'd me. Maybe you did six months. Maybe I was out in four, and that, children, is why we don't leave witnesses. That, children, <laughs> is why you don't rob people that you know. <laughs> no. Franklin, share. Yeah, come on, kid. It can't be worse than Trevor's. All right, man, shit. Okay, the score was like two stacks, man. 2G, take home on your first gig? Fuck, that ain't bad, man. Man, the whole score was two stacks. Only I didn't see none of that shit. Dive pack went off, homie. Money was useless then. Dive pack? <laughs> you amateur! I knew I shouldn't have told you shit. Hey, Franklin, we all gotta start somewhere. Last time I tell your ass something. All right, Frank, we're gonna drop you up here, okay? When you hear it kick off, get ready, because we're gonna want to go ASAP. I'm gonna get away, man. I'll do it. I wish we could have went out the getaway way, but it's a whole nother route. All, All right, right get you know where you gotta be? I got it down. I'll bring a die pack just for you. We ready for this? I could use a restroom break. And risk getting ID'd. You're an idiot. All right, we all good? Let's hit them. To never explain how the armor shit goes. Yes, yeah, sir, let's get this it. Is happening. This won't take a minute. Get down on the floor! Today's going one of two ways, friends. Everyone on the floor, now! You and you, out from behind the counter. That's it, hands in the air. M, keep an eye on our trusted employee. Okay, you, you got the crowd. Cops should be here soon, so keep an eye out. I think the door's just ready. Just try over it. Here. Kick it in, M. Evil. If I ever meet this Someone's long money. guy, fucking shoot him. Not if I get to him first. Yeah. How money? How much money do we get? All right. Stay back! We got hostages. <laughs> <laughs> Tell the sheriff the 211 is confirmed. We're gonna need everything we got down here. <laughs> Ooh, that's a lot of money we get. Sheriff's here. We never could have beaten that response. There's other ways of beating it. Oh yeah, y'all. Let's get it. I don't care if they surrender. I'm killing me some bad guys. Now let the hostages go, and uh, we'll talk like gentlemen. Time to face the music. Oh, yeah. Sweet mother shit. Yeah, spin that bitch up. Yes, Now let's get the fuck out of here! Incoming! 
go. Move. I got you covered. Come on, move, move. Go, Steve. Hey, there's cops in the bay. You ain't gonna be able to get out this way. You hear that, guys? Shit. We aren't getting out on the water. We gotta see this through. They're out to kill, not capture. Don't worry, we're gonna see it through We're my going through this, not with 50 pounds of gear. Blast it! That's it, bro! Unleash hell on it! Over there! Lay down your weapon! There is no way out! Hey, Frank! We need another escape route! I love the mini gun. Somebody might stand up gunfire! There's some construction around the way! I... Well, we have ruined someone's lovely home! The only thing your crib's missing is a fool with a burning helicopter in it. Keep behind the car! We gotta push through this roadblock. They got tack guys in Polito Bay! This is it! Let's go! More cops! Someone's walking through! That's what we need! More heat! I'm about to have a heart attack! <laughs> you have got to be kidding! I know that shit's scary as hell to be going doing this, man. I know that shit's scary. Fight the Anunnaki. You talking about that, um, the Asian civilization? War vehicle. So this is where our defense spending goes. This ain't nothing to do with you! The whole federal operation is screwed! Oh. Oh. T, 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 man, they're flying in the tank! We gotta move it! Like right now! Nah, flying in the tank is insane. How about I push this way while you would. Let's get it. Hey, you fools really been making a fucking mess out here. Hell yeah. yeah. Can't drive. I couldn't drive for a minute. Hey, you blocking the wrong road, man. We out the way. I almost hear it. How many dudes they got in this private army? How you doing, son? You hear that gunfire? That's how I'm doing. Come on, boy. We need to bring you in. Listen to the shoot. Here, take Ben. I shoot. Fuck off already. It's getting hairy over here. It's hairy over here, too, man. Chill. Oh, over here. There's a ride. Good kid. Go, 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 go. This is insane hey, to bring tanks like that. Hey, you calls. Ah, shit. Well, you know me and Trevor. Wherever we go, drama follows. That's one way of putting it. Hey, hold on. We ain't going to here. Ah, shit. That's that tank that flew over us. We gotta duck into that factory. Come on, the platform. Shit cakes. They're all over us. Come on! Come on! Oh my god! This way! Through the warehouse! Use me as cover, Frank! You don't want to get out front! Stay behind me, kid! I got the armor! 
smoking these motherfuckers. I'm starting to feel undressed, dog. How you doing back there, Frank? Nah, who I know this is scary to be doing this for real. We ducked into a chicken factory to get away from the tanks. Chicken factory? Oh, I see it. I'll try to head off anyone anyway. looks like they're going in. I told you, Chef was good people. Key to running a business is surrounding yourself with talent. I feel like the right manager unlocked his potential. Kid, you still alive? I like how Franklin actually stays in the back. There's even more of these bastards. You assholes! Shot him in his ass. Who else would be fucking this up? You stupid! Throwing a grenade! You're in the way! Is he gonna blow himself up? Train. It's our only shot! <laughs> you holding on, Ed? I need cover! Great to see you. All right, you do what you can do, Chef. I'm glad you got hired for the job. There's some guys trying to get in here. Chef's holding them off. Might give us the window we need to jump a train. And we got a train to catch. I think they think there's more than one of me. They're pulling back. Okay. Hey, slip out of town and call Lester for instructions. I got news. You're wasted in Trevor Phillips Inc., my friend. Chef caught us a break, people. Let's get our train. Look out! The end of the warehouse! Don't oh, with me! Hey. What the hell, man? Last call! Could be our only way out of here! Oh, here we go! Let's Are get you? it! Get on! Ah. Ah. <laughs> that was fun. That was fun. That was always a fun heist because it's so chaotic, you know what I'm saying? Plus, how many games you know Let's we were robbing a bank in the juggernaut suit? Uh, easy, easy. I'm a friendly. Agent Sanchez. Our very own corrupt G-man in training. You gotta be careful, buddy, all right? Because they are uh, looking around these trains for illegals. And if you're mistaken, you'll be shot, amigo. Very amusing. <laughs> if you expecting them two to bring you up, you're gonna be disappointed, homie. Right back at you. Got the money? Everything we got. Okay. Here's your cut. Considering present scrutiny on public worker remuneration, this is a big win. So bullshit. Oh yeah, that's a huge fucking win. Woo! It should be about four million for good. I'm split. out. Agent Haynes will get in touch with you once Operation Save the Worlds ago. Get your crew together, okay? Fucking punk. All right. We should probably split up. They're gonna be looking for a three. Oh, the blood we spill for the security of this country. Come on, Franklin. Man, I'll holler at you home. Hi. Right. Seatbelt. Serious. That was fun, though. Polito score. How much we get? Took 8 million, lost 33,000. The FIB took 6 fucking million? 6 million is what they took? That is insane that they took that much. Nah, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. That's insane. That's a lot of fucking money that they snatched up. Too much. That don't even make sense to be that much fucking money. But, I feel like this is a good stopping point. So I'm gonna end this video here. Please remember, if y'all like the content, to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. And after this game, I will be doing Saints Row or either Mafia. But I was gonna jump straight to Saints Row 2. But I also want to do Sleeping Dogs also. I never played Sleeping Dogs. So I only played like the first 30 minutes of it. But anyway, that's enough of me yapping. I will catch y'all in my next video. Deuces.